this patient was referred to me for endodontic treatment of tooth number 14. She received a crown. Well, that's a temporary crown right now. It's one of those uh, metal, really thin metal temporary crowns. And tooth started to hurt afterwards. We diagnosed the tooth as being uh, partially necrotic and uh, recommended root canal. And here's the post-op. As you can see, everything went beautifully. Four root canal systems, MB1, MB2, distal buccal and palatal. Everything went great, as you can see. We went ahead and temporized the tooth and referred the patient back to her dentist for the permanent restoration. Just wanted to make sure that you guys understand. When I don't find the uh, MB2 now, when I don't find it, I'm, I'm really concerned. I'm really concerned because 90% of the time plus, so 90% and more of the time, there is an MB2. So when I don't find an MB2, I trough, I look everywhere for it, I don't find it, I'm a little concerned. And I always tell you guys, if I can't find it, it's very likely it's not there. And I'm not trying to brag, but it's just that I have years and years of experience, decades of experience. But even even with me, when I when I can't find an MB2, I'm, I'm, I, I, I get a little concerned. So if you guys routinely don't find an MB2, you're missing them. You're missing them, I guarantee it. I guarantee it, you're missing them. And don't say, oh, you know, all my root canals were successful because I've never done a root canal or, and never had a patient come back to me and complain. Well, they don't come back to you. They usually go to another dentist or they go to another dentist and another dentist refers them to, uh, to uh, uh, an endodontist uh, for the retreatment. Or, or sometimes it just gets so sick and tired of having to deal with the tooth, the pain and all that stuff. They just go have it pulled. So don't say that just because you don't you when you do a root canal and uh, all your root canals are successful because you you know the patients that you do root canals on never come back to complain uh, or you you you've never had to redo your own root canal that is <laughs> that is not true I can tell you that uh, again uh, if you don't see your patients coming back. It's because it's not because your all your root canals are successful have been successful. It's because they chances are they go somewhere else. Your patients go somewhere else. They just don't come back to you. All right, but definitely look for these MB2s, and you can see two completely separate canals.